You know, I keep having this dream. It'd be 10 years from now. Be Felix. He's all right. And we're still tight. He got himself a job. A good one, too. He's like a captain at one of those fancy restaurants up in Manhattan. With tablecloths and ambience and shit. Fancy motherfuckers be all up in there in pinstrip suits. Anywho, I'd be out from another bullshit bit upstate. Rikers or whatever. But make no never mind, cause Felix be going out on a limb. He be pulling some strings for his old friend Speck, getting me a gig waiting on tables. And shit be working out too. But hold up, you wanna know where you come in? You wanna know what type of motherfucker you is in 10 years? You're the type to be coming in every so often. You're an every so often type of motherfucker, Charlie. You don't want to come in to bring some business to the joint your cousin work at, make you feel like Santa Claus and shit. You don't say hi to nobody. Just be walking in with your other $80 steak eating motherfuckers. Anywho, at the end, when you're walking out with your friends who talk up their chin, you be coming in and slipping me a Franklin. But in your mind, you be saying, here be some monies. So now I don't got to deal with your ass anymore until I be needing another steak. That's you in my dream. If I had to pick a different uh, occupation instead of acting, I think I'd pick something, I think I'd be an astronaut or a submarine person going, in, going into the deep waters um, traveling and finding the unknown. Um, yeah, I think there's ve something very powerful about the unknown. Like, we don't know anything about the space yet or the water. And I guess that's what I'm doing with acting, too, is exploring the unknown.